in with, with purpose. So I think it's going to be uh, Slenderman versus Starbase Fruit. With purpose, oh, I didn't see Starbase Fruit came in here. He's rocking two sweaters right now a sweater and a sweater vest. <laughs> That's that's high class. I mean, it is. That's little, high. It, it's actually a little chilly outside, so I don't blame them. Oh yeah. Uh, so at Starbase Fruit using the tag Mr. Dolphin because him and I have been talking a lot about Guilty Gear. Uh -huh. How uh, there is a girl, a character named May, uh -huh. who summons dolphins to help her space. Decent. Yeah, and so every time she uh, summons them, she goes, Mr. Dolphin, and then, like, a dolphin shows, or no, she summons it, and then when she has it do its attack, then she shouts out, Mr. Dolphin, and uh -huh. then it, like, attacks for her. That's a different game. He, he, uh, Sage, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put him on the spot. It's like, go Quackums, go, Quackums, go, and that's from Dragon Nest, which is an amazing, way more fun MMO than it should be. Rook before he picks it, so I look smart. He might play Diddy Kong. He's no. not gonna play Diddy. He's already talked to me about this. I, I, I wasn't, sure. I was, I was, I didn't know they were saving it for stream. So I was, I was trying to squeak it out before he could. So, so basically, it what's, what's smart. most likely gonna happen is, um, he's, he wants to, because this is the first time apparently they've ever played in bracket. So he wants to see how Luigi, his Luigi's gonna fare against. Uh, uh, Slender Man's, you know, really good, amazing link. Yeah. Um, and that doesn't work, he'll probably go Diddy get round two. Okay, okay. That, that's what I told him to do anyway, because that's just, you know, sometimes Luigi versus Swords does not work out correctly. Cyclone! And uh, SPF does have uh, another Luigi, part of the Luigi Nation right behind him. He's got Shell watching his back. One, go. Gonna give him that coaching. Slender Man with the ugly honey mustard skin. <laughs> SBF with that classic pink red. Yeah, that, that's the uh, oh yeah, and, and SBF. I don't know if he's using it yet, but he's been using. He's been practicing a new a new matching technique from DMG's brand, uh, James, in which um, you use B and Y at the same time mm -hmm. to mash, and you get a lot higher. You go B A Y A B A Y A, and you go yeah. you can go really high without really as much effort as normal uh, mashing. Yeah, uh, so basically like the technique with it is, oh, that, that's a kill. Yeah, there's no bomb, so he does get killed. Oh my goodness. So like you, you kind of put your thumb, like I'll use your controller as an example, you lay your thumb in between B and Y here, so your thumb is kind of barely touching Y. Oh, yeah, you've been practicing Luigi. Yeah, and then you just just kind of yeah, like vibrate, vibrate your forearm, forth, right? Yep, you yeah. vibrate your forearm, back and forth, you have to make sure you're completely off B and Y when you do it, because if you are holding B and hit Y, no input counts. Yeah, because because you're technically, then you're holding the button instead right. of, yeah. yeah. So you have to like, yeah, just put your thumb on A, and then your thumb just barely touches B and Y. Yep. Uh, the Cerebrate's Fruit with a very solid leader. Now Slenderman having a little bit of difficulty getting this stock. Mostly because Starbase Fruit's been keeping him off stage a lot. Uh, oh, Fireball saving, uh, saving Starbase Fruit from, from a possible up throw kill. Probably not though, yeah. yeah they're not going to kill just quite yet. Ooh, oh, very back hit of Forder. Gonna take that stock. One stock apiece here. SBF with a decent lead, but it's not impossible here for Slenderman to make a comeback by any means. Link puts on some huge damage. Yeah, and also because just because Link is so good at recovering sometimes. Oh, I think at Starbus Fruit, if I if I know Starbus Fruit, he was probably trying to land on that platform and come right back up with another down B. Ooh, okay. Slenderman starting to slowly get the percentage, but it's going to be Whoa. tough against Luigi. This might be his window. Ooh, good recovery from Slenderman to avoid that back air. Jumps right over the grab. Doesn't really capitalize oh. on all that landing lag and a good rare back air. Yeah, that was a really bad, uh, really bad DI there from Slenderman, too. I think it would have killed anyway, but uh, that was like straight right. Starbase Fruit is does take it, does take game one. So also we are running uh, the new rule set. So no Lilat, no du uh, Duck Hunt. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm wondering where they're gonna go. I'm not even sure where Starbase Fruit would ban in this layout. Mostly I can never remember what Luigi likes. <laughs> It looks like Starbur uh, no, uh, Slenderman is going to be going F Final Destination. Yeah. We're going to be sticking with these characters. Three, two, one, mm. go. 
Yeah, I'm not sure what his Ben would have been. I was trying to think of that the whole time. Just my assum my assumption is Battlefield. Right. I was going to say Triplat. Well, there's a lot of people that say oh, yeah, I guess I, Triplat. I guess I don't have to say Battlefield. It's yeah. just <laughs> Triplat. Ooh. Ooh, this is dangerous. That's he's all right. Make it back. He, he's, uh, he kind of mashed it in a place where it would be a little bit safe. Or service for going some really dirty down airs. Or for the double dare. Normally a Diddy Kong. Really good show. Um, I, I love whenever links do that. It looks so glitchy. Doing the, uh, the, the super wave, wave, wave throw. I don't remember what they actually call it. I like how Slenderman's using Nair to kind of break up these fireball approaches. Uh, he's either jabbing it or just nairing it, one of the two. Yeah, ja jabbing makes it, I mean, really if he doesn't have bomb, they could just let the high lane shield take care of it too. Yeah, very true. But that's one of those things that you don't want to make it, oh, Search or er, Slenderman got lucky that Search accidentally grabbed the Okay. Accidentally grabbed the bomb there. Accidentally grabbed the bomb and could have upbeat. Slenderman. Yeah. All right, Slenderman keeping a lot closer to this game. Neck and neck right now. Oh, oh, that was very, very convenient for Slenderman. Landed right in that tornado. Now, Service Fruit needs to find the stock. He's so good at chasing. Oh, that was beautiful. Mr. Dolphin taking that first stock. So now we are essentially even. Now Luigi with that lead. Ooh, that was a cute little footstool setup. This guy's got to find a way, and I like the use of up tilt there. I think a lot of people would have gone for grab just because you thought you were safe behind, but the up tilt reached around. It's good spatial awareness from SBF. Yeah, that, that up tilt, I, I feel like, is... I can't say it's slept on. It's, it's, it's a good move, right. but it's not used enough. Just because it's one of those situations like Diddy's neutral air where, like, it's the worst of his options technically. Right, yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, Slenderman's controlling space a lot better this game. Yeah, Slenderman's had some really good adaptations here. Jab 1, 2, and up. He was looking for Slenderman, or does SBF use a jump? He did not. Okay. Now, at this point, dash attack will kill. Forward air will kill. Ooh, forward air does kill. All right. It does kill. Slenderman finds it. We are going into game three. Do you think we're going to see the Diddy Cup? It looks like uh, we're gonna have sh maybe Shell coming in for a little bit of coaching, but <laughs> we do have we do allow coaching thirty seconds. Yep. If he does want to go for it, Ooh, he is. He decides to go for it. So oh, we got, we got oh, the and then Giant comes into the other side here. Yep. And and uh, technically this would be uh, Starbase Fruits uh, coaching, because we have a rule for that too, where it's it's like it's like actual football and actual sports where whoever instigates the coaching, it's like oh both sides are gonna go to the corner now. Yeah. Yeah. But it won't matter because it's a game three. Right. Luigi, Luigi Nation having each other's back at all times here. We're going to be moving into game three, and I can only imagine he's going to stay on Luigi after getting some advice from Shell here. All right, so we, uh, we just got the 30-second warning. <laughs> it's, it's just for the sake of uh, you know keeping keeping the show going. Yep. Uh, but I wonder if he's going to be sticking with that Luigi. Yep, like he I said, he's going to be sticking with that Luigi probably getting, after getting some coaching from Shell Ryukin himself. I, I, I don't blame him. So we're going back to Smashville? Didn't we go here again? Oh, yeah, there's no yes, uh, there's, yeah, no there's no DSR. Town and City. Yeah, there's no. No Town and City, no DSR, so this is absolutely the pick here. So we're trying so to catch a jump there off that ledge. Again, not again Slenderman is he's actually being very comfortably sitting right at the ledge. That's been kind of his safety place. Oh, I would have liked to have seen a re-grab there instead of jab one too. I think I think he was seeing what Slenderman would do with that it. Could be, that could and, be. Yeah. Cause because grab obviously is the like preferred option, but if you catch him air dodging, that might have killed. Sometimes you just have to take that risk. Almost dying to forward tilt. Oh, and that's gonna dead. be it. He's dead. Yep. Luigi is so gimpable with yeah, that jump. Slenderman very accurate with neutral airs. He talks a lot about how a neutral air, probably the most important gimping option for Link, is because of the angle that it sends people. Um, especially in Link Ditto. I know he knows uh, that a lot. 
but you know characters like Luigi who have difficulty getting you know they need that jump they need that tornado to even exist right uh, oh it is not jump back oh man oh, these man. are some terrifying offstage exchanges here yeah but technically right now Slenderman winning off in the trades oh no air dodge is right into that huge up smash that's gonna be a big damage. Service or uh, Slenderman starting to almost lap uh, Service Fruit. I mean, it needs to be said that if Service Fruit does get that stock, he still has the Tornado Camp if he needs it. Right. I would like to have seen it there. Oh, that oh, was that man. was supposed. To, that was a good option, but barely missed. Well, I mean, at this point, I think he doesn't want to risk throwing out the ooh, throwing out the Tornado just because he kind of probably wants to save that for. Yeah. Getting that last kill. He's off stage now, but ooh, I don't know. It's just, uh, I know, I know, you, I know what you're saying. You, know, yeah. you want to save your good option until the last one, but at this point, it, does that rule kind of go out the window? Yeah, I, I mean, right now, a lot of moves will kill Luigi. And not much of Luigi's. Like, it's so hard for Luigi to land those kill options. Especially against smash will kill right now. Especially against a, a character with a with a sword. Right. Luigi on Smash would absolutely kill right now. He's probably going to be looking for it soon if he doesn't get a grab. Slenderman's being so patient. Oh. Got to go with that it's bomb. You got a good read on him there, though. After he whiffs the grab, he will roll back. Yeah, it's very important at this percent. You need those hard reads. Right now, I think Slenderman's starting to try to corner him into a roll. Yeah, that's exactly what he did, and he catches him with that grounded up B, and that is going to be game three going to Slenderman. And that's Slenderman, a pretty big one for him. Yeah, and Slenderman with a very big adaptation. People were not sure if you know Slenderman or Starbase Fruit were should have been, I think they're about they're like right next to each other in the seating, so uh, we were, we knew this was going to be a close match. Right. So uh, you know Slenderman, especially with that last last game being two a two stock, uh, it worked Slenderman. Uh, clearly taking advantage of Luigi's difficult time getting in on zoning. Yeah. Uh